We are to the 12th house in the zodiac. That means we are to Pisces. Pisces is the symbol of the two fish, and they are the sign about secrets and about belief and about religion. Well, not religion, because religion is an institution. They are about spirituality. Pisces are the last house, so they're all about transcendence. They're very sensual, they're very sensitive, they're very into a real connecting when it comes to sex or relationships. They really want to connect with you on a deeper level before they ever really get into your pants. Uh, the two Pisces that I have dated because um, they're really hard to date, <laughs> especially if you're an inconstant Aquarius that's all over the place. They come and go inside my life. They, they find out that I'm really interesting, but then they kind of are like hurt by how forgetful I am. They are even more sensitive than a Cancer is. Cancers, they have that hard exterior shell to hide behind, so you don't really know if they're hurt or not. But with Pisces, you know they're hurt. Because they wear everything out there, you know? They really have all their emotions out there. One, the first of Pisces that I got to know was a guy who just was really all about trying to save me and change me. So on the light side, they are very much about truth. If you can't tell a Pisces the truth, then you might as well not bother. Sure, they have a lot of secrets, but they have a lot of hidden strengths. So if you are finding yourself in a relationship with a Pisces, you're gonna get surprised. You're going to be like, wow, I never knew that about you. You are really a strong person, even though at on the service they seem like they're not. Let's see here. I think that's all I really have to say about this sign.